uh, welcome friend, friends in our SSRS tutorial in this tutorial we are not going to focus to create any type of report first of all we are going to focus how to arrange our parameters in you can see these are the parameters year, quarter, sales month and week it could be possible in the beginning of the report yeah, the requirement is that in this report only require years and quarter to filter out your data but after some time the clients need two more parameters like sales week and sales month so in this case uh, we have to add two more parameters and this is the result that our parameters looks very conflicted on the reports so uh, clients wants to rearrange the parameters in your report so what can I do first of all uh, I am going to give you some concept of this report also N now we are creating a sales by country report and these are uh, these these are the our uh, data sets in our report now you can see we have a regional sales data this is the main data for the report like this okay and we have filtered this data like years quarter month and week okay now we have created dsv data set for week uh, where we are going to show you the weeks for a to filter out the data to create a parameter same we have created for month for quarter for year now we are go to our parameters like we have a week parameter and if I am going to the property section then you can see I have checked allow multiple values that means I can choose multiple values from this parameter and I have bound this parameter with my existing data set which I have created here that is sales week this is a sales week data set so I have also filled the default value here okay now same I did for month year quarter now I am going to preview of this report now you can see I am going to filter out my data I want to see the sales in a first week of the of the year and it would be the first month and I am going to filter out this data you can see all the years for first week and first month is available now I am going to filter out the year 2012 okay now you can see here you can see that uh, our parameters are not corresponding to each other because I am not using uh, here as a class carrying parameters so, so in this report all the parameters are working independently so first of all I need to rearrange my parameters so I am going to the design mode again in the design mode I am going to I, I am going to create uh, here my the first parameter in the report so I am going to move it and then quarter then month move up you can see that now I am going to preview my report again now you can see all the data is coming for the year now uh, what I am going to do here I am going to filter out the data like this year 2013 okay then new report now you can see the data is coming in year 2013 now I want to see the only quarter number 3 ok now you can see quarter number 3 is filtered out now uh, in quarter number 3 the other year should be 7, 8 month should be 7, 8, 9 so I am going to filter out month 8 ok now you can see only 8 months is coming here but weeks for 8 months is also available that is 34 33 and like this I am going to filter out it, it uh, as a 33 okay 